No, I really wanted to sit like this the whole time. Here's how I found out I was an alcoholic. I went to a restaurant, ordered a Coke, grabbed my Coke, and this is my reaction after drinking it. It was just, what the fuck? There's no whiskey in this? What the fuck is going on? Where's my whiskey? The waiter's like, um, well, first of all, you don't get 99 cent whiskey Cokes. <laughs> Second of all, this is communion. We don't even serve alcohol, you fucking idiot. <laughs> like, I'm sorry, I have a problem. Um, I go to school at Texas A&M. That's not fun. I miss Alaska so much. I'm so glad to be here for Christmas break. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I miss the snow in the mountains and all the snowboarding. I want to go snowboarding in Texas, but you just can't. There's no mountains at all. It's all flat. Like I'll give you a play-by-play -play of Texas. It's just like dirt, dirt. Everywhere you go, it's fucking dirt everywhere. And it's just flat. And there's just dirt everywhere. And every once in a while, you'll walk into a cactus. And then every once in a while, you'll, you'll walk again. And it's just more fucking dirt over here. And then there's NASCAR. It's like, fuck you. Nobody fucking cares about NASCAR. Get out of here. And then there's more dirt. And then there's the Bush family. Like, holy shit. Yeah. And then there's just more dirt and dirt. And then finally, there's Mexico over there. Like, what the fuck's going on? Am I in hell? What the fuck's happening here? I have to ride the bus a lot when I'm in Texas to get to campus because I don't have a car. It's not even that big of a deal. It's just like a fucking like half a mile of drive, so I could just walk. But I ride the bus, and as soon as I get on the bus, it's just like everyone has their headphones on, like plugged into their ears. Like, I don't know, everyone has this mentality like, I'm going to block the fucking world out today with my iPod. I don't get it. Like, you could be sucking my penis later if you would just talk to me. <laughs> I like to like just mess with people who are wearing headphones on the bus. I just like to mess with them. I'll get on the bus, and my first, my first, I'll, I will definitely sit next to the hottest girl on the bus. That's for sure. That's just instincts. But if, if there's no hot girls on the bus, I will fucking get straight over to the first person with headphones. And I'll sit right down next to them, and they don't hear me because I say to them, so I'll just wait for them to make eye contact. And this is real. Let's try this by the way. As soon as you uh, make eye contact with someone with headphones on, start talking. But don't actually talk, just move your mouth like you are talking. Like... As soon as they pop their headphones out, they're like, what did you say? Just like, I didn't say a fucking thing, you crazy bitch. <laughs> I don't have a whole lot of advice for people while I'm up here, but the one thing I do have advice for is, girls, if you have really nasty, saggy tits... <laughs> It's like a dream world for me. I wish I was good at fighting. 
Horrible at it though. Horrible. I don't, prefer, I, I don't like one-on-one -on -one fights all get killed. I don't really mind the, like, the group fights, like me and all my friends versus you and all your friends. That's not as bad because at least I got some backup. But the reason I don't like it, I, I don't mind it so much, is because it really reminds me of uh, Lord of the Rings. <laughs> it's just like two armies just charging at each other, like, <laughs> For more the <laughs> so, I prefer those over single things. And I actually, I actually learned that I'm horrible at fighting the bad way. I got my ass kicked. And that's when you know you suck at fighting. Is when you try to fight someone and you just get your ass kicked. It's not fun. But what happened was, and it's always like one of my other friends instigating the fights. It's never me. I don't ever want to fight anyone. It's always like one of my friends. That's just like an alpha of people. And what happened was, uh, I went to a bar with one of my buddies. I don't know if we can call a buddy for this. But I went to a bar with one of my buddies. And he sees like a gay couple from across from across the uh, bar, and they're kissing or something, it's weird, I don't, I mean, it's, yeah. <laughs> I don't mind it that much, really, it's their own business, but he's just like, mouthing off, you fucking faggots, fuck you, and I'm just like, dude, calm down, man, chill, chill, they're cool, they didn't do anything to us, really, but he gets thrown out immediately, and I guess they missed him getting thrown out. The problem with that whole thing was, uh, was me, he was standing behind me when he said it. <laughs> so it looked like I was the one yelling curse words at these guys. <laughs> you can replace the U with the A in guys. But, um, so one of them walks over and he's just like, walks straight up to me. And he's like, hey! <laughs> Why are you talking shit about me and my boyfriend? <laughs> he was a gay Chinese guy. <laughs> like, dude, I didn't even... It wasn't me, I'm sorry. It was my buddy. He's not here anymore, but it was definitely him. <laughs> it was definitely not me. And he goes to either... It was either a judo chop or a slap. I wasn't sure if it was the Chinese in him or the... The gay. <laughs> <laughs> One of those two. Uh, but my natural reaction is to just fucking block it. Fuck you. Punch you in the face. <laughs> but it was, seriously, I, I, I already mentioned I don't like fighting, but it was definitely the best punch I've ever thrown. Knocked him back. Never knocked anybody down. But he stumbled back a little bit. Just like, oh, no, you didn't. <laughs> like, listen, buddy, I don't want to fight you. We don't want to do this. I don't have anything against gays. I don't have anything against gay people or Asian people. Before I can even, like, reason with it, he fucking jumps up, flips around in the air, and Roundhouse kicks me in the face. And I go down immediately, and he just stands over me. I think he's going to beat the fuck out of me, but instead he just, like, turns around and... <laughs> right in my face. Right in my face.